instead of kind of getting cranky that, you know, Power BI hasn't done this or hasn't done that, you assemble your, your tools in a way that they do what you want them to do. Last night, as I was working on it, I posted a video about MCP, a combination I did with Obsidian and Claude. And the amazing thing about it was, I mean, it, it's a hugely useful tool for me. You know, it, it basically logs my prompts. Any, any prompt I want to save, it automatically logs it. It puts a whole um, standardized front matter on it. It puts the, the prompt itself the response. Um, it does a summary and kind of a critical assessment of the issues with the prompt and, and then just puts it right in my Obsidian um, vault. And it's now, you know, fully searchable and fully retrievable right from the AI. Like I don't, I don't have to jump between apps. I just type it and say, okay, like, give me, give me all the stuff I've done about um, Claude and Anthropic, and it'll say, okay, here are all your posts. And I'll say, okay, summarize that in three bullet points and add it to my running list of podcast topics. And it just does all that. And the thing that was amazing about it was it really felt like kind of the the true model of co-intelligence that Moloch's been you know, writing about. That So I basically came to, to Claude and said, okay, here's what I want to do. And then Claude said, okay, that's cool. Do you want me to make a template of, you know, for Obsidian? And I'm like, yeah, that'd be great. And so it made a template. And then we talked about the template for a bit and, you know, we modified it a little. And then I said, okay, here are the custom instructions that I wrote for you. Because none of the models at this point can modify their own custom instructions, which is probably a good thing. Um, that's probably a safety thing, but... Mm -hmm. um, so I, I basically uploaded the custom instructions I wrote and it wrote back and said, okay, these are good, but here are some suggestions to make it better. And the suggestions it made were really good. And mm -hmm. it was like, we, we truly were kind of working in partnership. You know, it, it was better at programming the obsidian template stuff. I was better at kind of the, the larger concept and, putting the custom instructions together, but then it's technical knowledge of that stuff really polished it. And it just works flawlessly now. And, you know, it really felt like kind of a neat partnership. Um, it sounds weird, but it was kind of indistinguishable from if I'd been on a conference call or a, a chat.